How to update an app source app in your environments. Hey, I'm Eric, and um, this is a question that I get a lot. So I thought, let me actually do a little quick how to video on this. So the situation is that you have your business central production environment or sandbox environment running, and there's an app source app that's been updated. Um, could be by yours truly or somebody else and you need to update get it updated normally microsoft will update whatever apps you have installed to the newest version of the app every time they do a major update so you're going from 18 to 19 and now from 19 to 20 you will get all fresh apps at that point um, but if you don't want to wait a half a year for a new app update i can show you how you can do it faster and um here is a, a tenant. And the first thing you need to do is actually go to Admin Center. So you hit the gear and open Admin Center. If you do not have Admin Center here, that means that you are not a Dynamics 365 administrator. So you will have to find the user that's an admin. When you get into Admin Center, you're you'll get a list of all the environments that are in your tenant. In this case, I have one production environment and I have three uh, sandboxes. Um, so let me go and do, let's take the one called demo here. And you can see that those updates for, from, for the base application that I'm, I'm gonna get 19.4 soon. Uh, but if I click apps up here, in the upper left corner, you'll see all the apps that has been installed from AppSource. So if you look in, um, if we're in the environment in extension, ma extension management, we can see that all the apps that has been published as global, they will show up here. And uh, we can see that I'm actually pretty so installed version, latest available version, we're up to date. But I think I left, you know, there's one here. Um, and actually let me resize the screen so you can see what happens. So in this case, the simple object designer, a new version came the other day, lots of new fancy features, but uh this environment has version 3 installed and version 4 is not available and i can install update i install update and we get a circle thing going update is scheduled i can go up to the top here and hit refresh and we can now see that the status is updating let me go up and hit refresh again Still updating, hit refresh once more, still updating, and I'll hit refresh a couple more times. Let's scroll down and check, still updating. Um, again, this is getting scheduled on Microsoft's update servers, uh, services, and um, sometimes it's super fast, other times you wanna record a video about it and then it's slower. Um, one thing you shouldn't do well, while we're waiting, you should not do this while there's lots of users in the system working because potentially they will get a message saying that, hey, the admin has updated something, please restart your session. And potentially you can get uh, long running uh, operations to, to break. Uh, typically that won't happen, but you that that is a possibility. And now you can see that the object designer has been updated. So now this is running the newest version. And uh, there's one more scenario that you might encounter. And that is that some apps are split in multiple apps. Uh, so there might be a, a order of updates that you need to do. So you need to update the like a core or basic or library or whatever it's called in here update that first before you can update the main app. Um, but when you get to this point where everything is up to date, then you are on the newest versions of all the apps that you have installed. So that's how you upgrade a uh, AppSource app in your environment to the newest version. Uh, 
have fun and if you want to see more videos from me check this one out it's a good one take care bye